Welcome to Mother and Refuge of the End Times. Today we present to you a message from our Lord Jesus to Jennifer. Let us begin with a prayer. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our debts, as we forgive our debtors. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. A message from our Lord Jesus to Jennifer on April 5th, 2024. My child, I tell my children that I am not the conductor of fear. Rather, I am the vessel of hope and love, the artery of mercy for the whole world. My children, I have warned mankind in great repetition that the time has come to turn away from sin and seek out my mercy. Do not delay, out of fear or slumber, from removing the filth that has consumed your soul. My children, you cannot grow in holiness if you are not tending to the soil in which seeds are to be planted. My children, there is a great pursuit for your soul, and you must recognize that Satan's lies and deception are unrelenting. I warn my people that the veil of protection upon America is soon to be lifted if it does not repent. My mother has kept this nation under her mantle, but if her children fail to atone, then the veil will be removed for a time. The injustice brought upon my little ones has provoked the just anger of my father. The world is soon to be brought to Calvary when the hour of warning comes. Take heed, my children, for you being given this time of grace to repent and live your life in conformity to the will of your Heavenly Father. Now go forth, for I am Jesus, and be at peace, for my mercy and justice will prevail. Thank you for watching our channel. Please check out our 24-7 live prayer room. Please see the video descriptions for our books and social media. May God bless you and keep you. And may the Immaculate Heart of Mary be your refuge. Amen. The Chaplet of Our Lady's Tears, as revealed by a Lord and His Mother to Stigmatist Sister Amalia of Jesus Scourged in Brazil. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Ghost. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come. Thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Crucified Jesus, we fall at your feet and offer you the tears of the one who, with deep compassionate love, accompanied you on your sorrowful way of the cross. Grant, O good Master, that we take to heart the lessons which the tears of your Most Holy Mother teach us so that we may fulfill your holy will on earth, that we may be worthy to praise and exalt you in heaven for all eternity. The First Mystery The Prophecy of Simeon Let us meditate upon the tears shed by our Most Holy Mother during Simeon's prophecy that a sword would pierce her heart. Let us reflect on the sorrow Our Lady had knowing the sufferings of Jesus in advance. O oh, Jesus, look upon the tears of the one who loved you most on earth and loves you most ardently in heaven. O oh, Jesus, hear our prayers for the sake of your most holy mother's tears. O oh, Jesus, hear our prayers for the sake of your most holy mother's tears. O oh, Jesus, hear our prayers for the sake of your most holy mother's tears. O oh, Jesus, hear our prayers for the sake of your Most Holy Mother's tears. 
O Jesus, hear our prayers for the sake of your Most Holy Mother's tears. O Jesus, hear our prayers for the sake of your Most Holy Mother's tears. O Jesus, hear our prayers for the sake of your Most Holy Mother's tears. The Second Mystery, The Flight into Egypt Let us meditate upon the tears shed by our Most Holy Mother during the exile to Egypt, Herod's persecution, and Our Lady's sorrows for the death of the Holy Innocents. O Jesus, look upon the tears of the one who loved you most on earth and loves you most ardently in heaven. O Jesus, hear our prayers for the sake of your Most Holy Mother's tears. O Jesus, hear our prayers for the sake of your Most Holy Mother's tears. O Jesus, hear our prayers for the sake of your Most Holy Mother's tears. O Jesus, hear our prayers for the sake of your Most Holy Mother's tears. O Jesus, hear our prayers for the sake of your Most Holy Mother's tears. O Jesus, hear our prayers for the sake of your Most Holy Mother's tears. O Jesus, hear our prayers for the sake of your Most Holy Mother's tears. The Third Mystery Jesus is Lost in the Temple Let us meditate upon the tears shed by our Most Holy Mother during her search for Jesus. Let us consider the sorrows of Our Lady in her motherly heart. O Jesus, look upon the tears of the one who loved you most on earth and loves you most ardently in heaven. O Jesus, Hear our prayers for the sake of your Most Holy Mother's tears. O Jesus, hear our prayers for the sake of your Most Holy Mother's tears. O Jesus, hear our prayers for the sake of your Most Holy Mother's tears. O Jesus, hear our prayers for the sake of your Most Holy Mother's tears. O Jesus, hear our prayers for the sake of your Most Holy Mother's tears. O Jesus, hear our prayers for the sake of your Most Holy Mother's tears. O Jesus, hear our prayers for the sake of your Most Holy Mother's tears. The Fourth Mystery Mary Meets Jesus on the Via Crucis Let us meditate upon the tears shed by our Most Holy Mother during the tortures of Jesus caused by the scourging, the crowning with thorns, the suffering for the wound on his shoulder, his falls, and the painful stripping of his garments. O Jesus, look upon the tears of the one who loved you most on earth and loves you most ardently in heaven. O Jesus, hear our prayers for the sake of your most holy mother's tears. O Jesus, hear our prayers for the sake of your most holy mother's tears. O Jesus, hear our prayers for the sake of your Most Holy Mother's tears. O Jesus, hear our prayers for the sake of your Most Holy Mother's tears. O Jesus, hear our prayers for the sake of your Most Holy Mother's tears. O Jesus, hear our prayers for the sake of your Most Holy Mother's tears. O Jesus, hear our prayers for the sake of your Most Holy Mother's tears. The fifth mystery, the crucifixion of Jesus, his agony and death. Let us meditate about this abyss of sufferings and the piercing of his sacred heart by the lance. O Jesus, look upon the tears of the one who loved you most on earth and loves you most ardently in heaven. O Jesus, hear our prayers for the sake of your Most Holy Mother's tears. O Jesus, hear our prayers for the sake of your Most Holy Mother's tears. O Jesus, hear our prayers for the sake of your Most Holy Mother's tears. 
O oh, Jesus, hear our prayers for the sake of your most holy mother's tears. O oh, Jesus, hear our prayers for the sake of your most holy mother's tears. O oh, Jesus, hear our prayers for the sake of your most holy mother's tears. O oh, Jesus, hear our prayers for the sake of your most holy mother's tears. The sixth mystery, the Pietà. Let us meditate upon Our Lady receiving the lifeless body of Jesus in her arms. Let us ponder the sentiments of Our Lady at that time. O oh, Jesus, look upon the tears of the one who loved you most on earth and loves you most ardently in heaven. O oh, Jesus, hear our prayers for the sake of your most holy mother's tears. O oh, Jesus, hear our prayers for the sake of your most holy mother's tears. O oh, Jesus, hear our prayers for the sake of your most holy mother's tears. O oh, Jesus, hear our prayers for the sake of your most holy mother's tears. O oh, Jesus, hear our prayers for the sake of your most holy mother's tears. O oh, Jesus, hear our prayers for the sake of your most holy mother's tears. O oh, Jesus, hear our prayers for the sake of your most holy mother's tears. The seventh mystery, Jesus is taken to the tomb. Let us meditate upon the sufferings of Our Lady until the moment of the resurrection. O oh, Jesus, look upon the tears of the one who loved you most on earth and loves you most ardently in heaven. O oh, Jesus, hear our prayers for the sake of your most holy mother's tears. O oh, Jesus, hear our prayers for the sake of your most holy mother's tears. O oh, Jesus, hear our prayers for the sake of your most holy mother's tears. O oh, Jesus, hear our prayers for the sake of your most holy mother's tears. O oh, Jesus, hear our prayers for the sake of your most holy mother's tears. O oh, Jesus, hear our prayers for the sake of your most holy mother's tears. O oh, Jesus, hear our prayers for the sake of your most holy mother's tears. O oh, Jesus, look upon the tears of the one who loved you most on earth and loves you most ardently in heaven. O oh, Jesus, Look upon the tears of the one who loved you most on earth and loves you most ardently in heaven. O oh, Jesus, look upon the tears of the one who loved you most on earth and loves you most ardently in heaven. O oh, Mary, Mother of love, sorrow, and mercy, we beg you to unite your prayers with ours so that Jesus, your divine Son to whom we turn, may hear our petitions in the name of your maternal tears and may give us, in addition to the favors we ask, the crown of everlasting life. Amen. By your divine meekness, O Jesus bound, save the world from the error which threatens it. O Virgin most sorrowful, your tears have destroyed the infernal empire. Amen. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Ghost. Amen. Welcome to Mother in Refuge of the End Times. We are thrilled to be releasing our latest prayer book titled The Most Holy Rosary, Prayers and Mystical Meditations of Saints and Seers. The Most Holy Rosary is one of the greatest prayers in the history of the Church, garnished as it is with the testimony of saints and popes for the last thousand years, the only prayers that could be said to be greater are those of the Mass and the Divine Office, yet many still seek ways to enter into the deeper mansions of spiritual richness to be found in this devotion. To assist with this process, Mother and Refuge of the End Times has compiled revelations and meditations from some of the most notable and popular Catholic mystics and saints. 
these mystics were gifted with first-hand revelations by means of visions and apparitions of the life of our Lord Jesus and his Holy Mother. We have selected some writings from these remarkable revelations to assist in the meditation of each of the 20 mysteries of the Holy Rosary. The main mystic meditations featured are St. Padre Pio, Blessed Anne Catherine Emmerich, Servant of God, Don Delindo Rotolo, Servant of God Luisa Picaretta, Maria Valtorta, and others. In addition, this unique rosary prayer book contains both the Latin and English prayers of the rosary. It has been originally illustrated by our own Catholic religious illustrator with over 23 inspiring illustrations that will surely lift your hearts in prayer and in fervor. This is a rosary prayer book that will surely be a classic. As always, we thank you all for your continued support of our prayer book ministry in our channel. May God bless you and keep you, and may the Immaculate Heart of Mary be your refuge. Amen.